After a contentious race for the White House, Donald Trump is headed back to the Oval. He will become only the second president in U.S. history to serve two non-consecutive terms. Meantime, Vice President Kamala Harris addressed the nation this afternoon in her concession speech, speaking at her alma mater, Howard University, an all-black university, historic black university. She thanked her family, her supporters and friends, and said she was proud of how she and her team ran this campaign. Harris said while today is an emotional day, she wants us to accept the results of the election and maintain the importance of a peaceful transfer of power. Now I know folks are feeling and experiencing a range of emotions right now. I get it. <laughs> but we must accept the results of this election. Earlier today, I spoke with President-elect Trump and congratulated him on his victory. I also told him that we will help him and his team with their transition and that we will engage in a peaceful transfer of power. President Biden also called Donald Trump and invited him to the White House for an in-person meeting. Mr. Biden will address the nation tomorrow on the results of the election and the transfer of power.